Move back. The Wapians in black. Saving souls in black and gold. Free partner by Yanoon, know we love you. Tour. Marar 24, Detroit, Michigan, represent the United Wapian Nations worldwide. Tour. Okay. We're living this agreement. We're living that peace. You know what I'm saying? We in the image and likeness of them. You know what I'm saying? Worshiping a false god. That's unseen. Spooky. So when it's supposed to be our ancestors, you know, you a confirmation that your ancestors exist. The children of the dark world, who they call the angelic beings. But when it comes to that God, you know what I'm saying, that's unseen or that Jesus, you know what I'm saying, or that Allah, that's not on our frequency. So where y'all so at? Where y'all teaching that? Right there on the back. See, one question, brother, that you can ask yourself, where it say, in the Bible, where it say, let there be light. Does something inside of you ask you, who was that asking for the light? And where it says, let us make man in our image after our likeness. So they will tell you that that's one person talking, but doesn't your own reason tell you that that sounds like more than one person talking? And if it's one person talking, why would he have to talk to himself and ask permission for something that he already has the power to do? So that confirmation let you know right then and there that it was more than one person talking. So what you're going to find out it was one, none other than the angelic beings who we call them the Lord, or the uh, Elohim, who was asked permission to the Most High God to let there be light. So you're going to find out that there was more than one God. You know, we deal with facts pertaining to that and many other subjects. We deal with the facts, taking us out of the realm of belief, of fiction. Because that's what day and time is that we're in the sun cycle. It's that time for us to wake up as, as a people. sound right reason is right knowledge right wisdom and a right overstanding it's transforming information into affirmation whether it be finite or infinite nine ether here follow mm-hmm check it out grows out right. the number nine bears grow out form the number six you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying but we they they've been trained to tell us that that's good here the six but it's really flank it's the mm -hmm. same as dog mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying look at all that's why when White women or white people get wet, they be like, smell like wet dogs, you know what I'm saying? Because literally they got the same hair texture, you know what I'm saying? Look at all our women. Our women refuse to wear their natural hair. And now we start loving our women who wants to look like white women. So we just as confused as our women is. Messed up. Yeah, we like the weave now. You know? Science, history, religion, you know what I'm saying? All of them. 
And uh, any question you want, you know what I mean? And this, this is uh, the address right now. Yeah, so I'm gonna get this oh, to you. Know, he just gave me one. Okay. knowledge all our lives as a people. So in this day and time, within the, after the equinox going into the 10,000 year, we're now having Wubu Wow being presented to us. It's Ooh. the renewal of our story. Appreciate this that. right here is facts beyond a shadow of a doubt. Sound okay. right reason. You know, this is concrete evidence. You know, anything that you read in Wubu Wapu, you can research and investigate. And that's why I said you realize that what, what, what they try to keep from us is our natural way of life. Right. And said it's a mystery. Mm -hmm. But they want to feed us his story. Right. And now we're living in this image and this likeness, you know, being dumb, deaf, and blind, and not realizing who we are and who they are not. Right. You know, so we are the chosen ones. We are the children of the Tharu, of what the churches and religions call, you know, the angelic beings, right. or the Muslims call the Malachi cat. You know, so dealing with the mistranslations and the misinterpretations of what they wanted us to learn in religion, what he came to do is right the wrong and give us the right translations, the right interpretations in the many languages that the scriptures was originally given. Right. And within that, that's what you get the facts without a shadow of a doubt. Okay, man. I appreciate that, man. Thanks for that, man.